hello everyone welcome back to the channel uh, in today's video we will see how we can calculate median in sql so generally speaking uh, there is no direct function to calculate median in sql uh, generally for average max minimum some we have direct functions but for median we don't have so in this video we will see how we can calculate median using two methods second method is using percentile count function this is a very specific to SQL Server or few more databases, but it is not a generic solution. So we will discuss that also. And the first solution is a generic solution. So this we can use in any database. So we will discuss this first and then this one. Okay, so let's start. So before starting, let's understand what is median. So median is, let's say you have a set of numbers. For that, you have to find the middle number. So let's say you have one, two, three, four, five. So you have five numbers, right? So how you calculate the median? You sort the numbers. These are already sorted and find the middle one, right? Let's say you have 10 and 12 also. Okay. So if you see, this is one, two, three, four, five, six numbers. Let's say you have one more 14. So middle number will be four. So median is four in this case. It is not average, average will be different. So if there are odd number of records, you have to find the me middle one and that will be the median. In this case, it is four. Let's say you have even number of records. Let's say you have 16 also. So what you have to do, you have to find the two middle numbers. So two middle numbers will be 10 and four in this case, right? And take the average of those. So 10 plus four, 14 divided by two, seven. So in this case, median will be seven. So I hope it is clear in case of odd number of records, you have to take the middle one. In case of even number of records, you have to find the two middle numbers and uh, get the average of it. Okay. I hope it is clear. So let's, uh, uh, let's implement it now. So I have this table employee table and I have employee age. So I want to calculate the median of the employee age. So let me sort. So what do we have to do to find the median? We have to first sort the age and then take the middle one, right? So I will sort it order by age. Also, I will put a row number column. Over order by employee age. The sending order as row number okay. if i run this so if you see the mini i have uh, assigned the row number from in ascending order so the minimum age has, age has got one and the maximum has got 10 so in this case if you see we have even number of records so what will be the median it will be middle two records five six so the age is 37 and 39 in this case and we have to take average of it which is 38 in case of odd odd number of records, I will just take the middle one. So let's say if I put EMP underscore ID, so I'm removing the last record. EMP ID 10, I'm removing. I'm just saying EMP ID less than 10. In this case, in this case, I have nine records, right? And I will take the middle one, which is 37. So in this case, median will be 37. So now let's see how I can calculate it. So what I am going to do now, so I have calculated row number with the ascending order of employee age. So I will name it as ASC, RN underscore ASC. I will calculate one more row number, but this time it is in descending order. Okay. And this will be TESC. Okay. Here we are talking about the scenario when we have odd number of records. I have filtered out one record. Okay. After that, we will see how we can do for even also. So if you see in this case, the this is in uh, ascending order and this is row number in descending order of age. So if you see only for the middle one, these two will be same, right? Right. So the median will be 37. So if I just say that give me record where ascending row number is equal to descending row number, it will be what? I will get the median record or I can also say where ascending row number minus descending row number equal to zero. It is same thing. If I subtract these two, it will be zero. So I can do that also. 
okay but we have to handle the other scenario also where the number of records are even so i will just remove this filter now and again analyze it so if i again analyze this these these are my median records right 37 39 and average of it is 38 so if you see for these two records the difference between ascending and descending row numbers is 1 here it is minus 1 here it is 1 right minus 1 1 minus 1 so what i am going to do i will if i what what if i say give me the records where the difference between row number ascending and descending is less than or equal to 1 right i can find the absolute difference absolute means 5 minus 6 and 6 minus 5 will be 1 right absolute uh, uh, converts negative number to positive number i will use that function but if i say the difference between these two columns if less than or equal to 1 then it will handle both the scenarios it will handle the odd number of the record scenario because that is zero and even number of the record scenario also because it is one or minus one so i will use that property to find the median so i will just name it as ct i will create ct okay I will keep it as commented for now. Select star from CT. AL. R and ascending. Minus. R and descending. I will take absolute of it. So if it is negative, it will make it as positive itself. Minus one will become one. It's greater than or equal to zero. So in this case, we have handled both the scenarios, right? So I will run this now. Okay, let me run this. Sorry. Uh, less than or equal to one, it should be, right? So we handled both the scenarios. Sorry for that. So, because I had even number of records, I got the two middle one and I can take average now. So, I will put average on top of it. I will get 38. Okay. Let's see odd number of records. So, I have nine records and I got the 37 again here, the fifth record and I got the median, right? So, if I take average of this, average of one number will be average that number itself, right? So, it doesn't matter. And for the even, I have to get the average. So I will just put here average now. Average of MPH. So for the even number of records, it will be 38 because it was 37 and 39. Order by I need to remove. I got 38. And in case of odd number of records, I will get the middle one 37. I hope this is clear. This is very very common questions in the interviews how to calculate the median now we will check the another method too using percentile count and this is very straightforward one so again select star from emp okay. and then percentile count i will explain how this works so i am giving 0 0.5 within group order by emph over okay so this is how it works okay uh, percentile count sorry i forgot the Okay, I need to give colon here. Oh, sorry. This is percentile count. Okay. If I run this now. So if you see, I got the median here, 38. It is 37 and 39 and average of this 38, right? So I directly got the median. And if let's say I, I want to check for the odd number of records. So I will again put a filter 
EMP underscore ID less than 10. So I will get the middle number here. So if you see, I got the 37. So how this work? So what percentile count is, is you have to pass a number between 0 to 1. So what I am saying, sort my data based on employee age and give me the uh, give me the row which has the which is at the 50th percentile right so middle number will be at 50th percentile so you have to pass the order by on what column you want to order and then give me give me the 50th percentile column the middle column right and over clauses over the full table i am doing let's say you wanted to you wanted to for each department you wanted to calculate the median right separate median so you can give here partition by department id okay. i run this so now it is giving for each department it's giving the median for this department separate median and for this department separate median. okay these are this this is 200 and this is just 300 i hope it is clear in this first method also you can put partition by department id and you will get uh, a separate median for each department i hope this is clear uh, please do try yourself this is a very important concept um, if you have liked this video, please like, uh, hit on the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.